right, let's practice a bit more on the plot formatting. Let's say in this case you have again a simple scatter plot, an xy plot, and you want to change the direction of the scales. Right? The command for that one would be LAS. So with LAS you can change the direction of the scales over here or of the axis. You can choose numbers from 0 to 3. In this case I want to change the direction. Uh, from horizontal to vertical of the x-axis and the number for that one would be 3. So with LAS 3 the direction here would change. The next thing we want to work on is the coloration of those symbols in the plot because now they are preset to black and let's say we want to change the color for that. We would just use the color argument, col equals quotations, and we can fill in a color which we would like to use. In this case, I just choose red. And again, you have the color palette with a colors function, which we did or which I showed you in the last video. This color red, and as you can see with this command, the color changed to red. We can also change the shape of those symbols. The argument for that would be PCH equals. Now you have several options. One option is you can use the symbols on your computer. So then you would use the quotation mark and then you can choose any letter or any symbol. In this case I just use the symbol X or the letter X. I'm going to run this one and now the circle changed to an X. There are also preset symbols on your computer and they have numbers from 1 to 30. So for example, if you would use PCH equals number 20, then you would get a full circle. Alright, so in this video I showed you how you can change the color of those symbols and how you can change the shape of the symbols and we also dealt with the direction of the axis. And as a last thing, I want to show you a few examples of preset symbols which you can use for your plots. Therefore, we go to example, points, As you can see here, there is a table of different plot symbols with the corresponding numbers. So when you have your XY plot and you have the PCH command, with this number you can change the shape of your symbol in your plot. This was Martin from amainustutorials.com. Please do not forget to subscribe and to give this video a thumbs up if you liked it and if you found it helpful. If you have any questions, you can contact me directly at my website amainustutorials.com or you could, for example, leave a comment. Furthermore, just take a look at the other videos I prepared for you on the topic of R programming.